Hey YouTube, it's Nathan and Draw here, and today I have a, another figure review, and I'm actually pretty excited about this one, cause this is the first figure I've gotten that's not really based off of anything, or at least I don't think it's based off of anything. I couldn't find any information on it. Uh, it's a original character, I think, based off some sketches, and I just think it looks pretty awesome. Ordered it from a HLJ like in April or May and it just arrived today it was like pushed back so many times and it's by Embrace which is a company I've never heard of but yep and here is the figure itself now a little warning to the younger collectors out there. Um, it doesn't come fully assembled and by that I mean it comes naked in the box and I was like uh, okay <laughs> so I had to put all the clothes on and everything which I didn't expect because I didn't think it was gonna uh, be naked so luckily <laughs> when I opened it there was no one around or else I would have been like oopsie but yeah it's a pretty gorgeous figure, I think. There's the face. And it comes with bits of armor that I didn't put on because it was just too much of a hassle. Plus, I liked it to look better without the armor on. But yeah, so it has a, the, the dress which you have to wrap around and clothe her. The feet come assembled with the armor on it, so you don't have to do anything like that. And the base is pretty awesome. It's like she's standing on a stone or something. And her little mace is on a chain and it moves. And then there's a little messenger frog down there by her feet, which you have to peg into the, the base. And there's the figure in its entirety. I think it looks pretty awesome. If anyone knows if it's actually based on something, then let me know, but I'm pretty sure it's an original, based off an original sketch. I don't remember the artist's name, but yeah. So yeah, just a really quick one. I don't really have anything to say since it's not really based off of anything, so I can't say if it's uh, accurate to uh, the anime or manga or anything like that. But for what it is, and the sketches, based off the sketches, it's it looks really awesome. The head is removable, but it's not on a ball joint. You have to remove it to put on those neck braces or whatever. And the arms come off as well. And uh, yeah. This is the figure one more time. That's the base. And there's the face. Let's get a close up of that. And yeah, that's too close. Yep. So thanks for watching. This was the Infinite Draw. Rate, comment, subscribe. Uh, tell me what you think about the figure. I'm interested to know if you guys would ever get something like this that's not really based off of uh, any show or anything like that. This is the first one I've ever gotten that's not really based off of anything that I know of. But I just thought it looked so awesome that I couldn't like pass it up. So, yeah. Thanks for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe. I will see you in the next video.